the wheat and tares. Hey, do they want to fight? They don't fight fair. It is hard dealing with people that are liars. Satan was given the title by God, Father of Lies. And I've learned a lot doing this, brothers and sisters. I hope you have too. We are truly doing this together. This is what the last days look like. It's like, I I do this every day. I do it for many reasons. Like I kind of need to do this. I can't sit on this information. I am certain, 100% certain, the world is biblical, Jesus is true, and then we're dealt with the world. What do we do? Do we, you know, do we go and fight? Fight Jane Lynch here? She wants to fight. But no, we don't fight that way. The way I'm trying to do it is expose this for what it is, and by that I'm showing something on screen and then talking about it and saying, look, see, see what they're doing? I'm not just making stuff up. I do this to be a good and faithful servant. I do this because I'm passionate about it. It's the truth. It's like, if there was any time for me to stand up for something in my life, it's God. It's Jesus Christ. It's his truth. And then the side effect or the thing that goes along with that is Satan's fallen biblical world. The Lord has made it all, but Satan has his time and this is one of those, you know, why would God allow stuff? I get those questions and I've asked God. I've gone to God in prayer. There's not easy answers to some of this stuff. Brothers and sisters, I do this every day with you. We do this every day. Sometimes I still can't believe it. It, it really feels like us against the world. And Jesus is the leader. He's the good shepherd. Let's get that straight. We know that. 100% fact, follow the Lord Jesus. We don't need to go and fight. We don't need to get violent. We need to pray. We need to do our Father's will by being good and faithful servants, good brothers and sisters, loving God with all our heart, mind, soul, and strength, and loving our neighbor the way we want to be loved ourselves. So ranting on, Jane Lynch. She hosts the new Weakest Link, I guess. I saw it the other day with my grandparents. I don't know much about this person, but the wheat and tares, they want to fight, huh? They don't fight fair. They're liars. They've got the sign of success on their hands, 666. They've always got some kind of biblical reference, whether it's angel wings, a halo, or fallen angel wings. They do the vow of silence, keeping the secret. And then they do stupid one-eye symbolism like this there, right? It's all of them. It's models like Kristen Froseth here, or however you say her name, Christine Froseth. They're doing the vow of silence, keeping the biblical secret. They're slam dunking it, covering half their face, covering one eye. How many times have I said this for one eye symbolism? Covering one eye, having one eye revealed. Covering one eye, having one eye revealed, sticking out the tongue. And where do they love to spend their time? Where do they love to spend their time? on the Freemason checkerboard. I don't plan this stuff. This stuff just comes up because it's there so often. Brothers and sisters, God bless you. I love you. I will see you soon. See you in the air. Amen.